Quick disclaimer, this video was made with early access, so if anything changes, it will be noted in the comments. Apart from that, use the time skips if you're here for a specific section. Let's start. For Caddyshack, killing with the golf cart refers specifically to running enemies over. Both the driver and passenger will receive progress, so it doesn't matter who drives. Just hop on and have fun, but don't crash. There'll always be one cart on the left pathway and another near the weapons range, so all four players can immediately take the left and begin the farm. Tiny note, dominated enemies don't count. Then Lucky Strike is just an item hunt. 5 horseshoes will spawn in 16 possible locations, and upon the 5th one picked up, everyone in-game gets it. All the possible locations will be shown later in the gameplay section as usual. Martial Law is an individual achievement, and since there's only one turret, players will have to take turns. There's a fair bit of information not relevant to the achievement, but some might still be interested, so pause and read if you are. Otherwise, we'll continue. Theoretically, we'll encounter two marshals every minute, meaning it'll take two minutes to do this. But the AI parting and navigation is quite sketchy during my experience, so it would most likely take longer. Thus, we don't want to drag it out and have them die to anything but the turret. So disable the AI, don't bring converts, don't buy Elia, and watch what we shoot. Including the original position, there are 6 turret bases around the barns. I find the original position to be the best, since it has a good view of the surroundings. So I'll hang around it until I spot some marshals, then hop on and take them out. Rinse and repeat. Note that the turret ammo is limited, so don't go spend it all at once and save some for the new enemy. And for the last, Texas treasure, we'll have to look around the map for a hammer and a mole, then assemble it on the anvil in this northern weapons barn. With that done, we'll also need silver ingots to use with the tools. Crack open the wooden panel at the western barn's south staircase to find them. Interact with the anvil to create a sherry star and then pick it up. Each player must pick up the star themselves for the achievement and can only hold one. Also another tiny note is that the anvil will produce only 4 stars per game, so restart if we need to. And that's it. Several gameplays and location videos will be coming up soon, so hang around. Again for those in a hurry, go ahead and use the time skips. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.
I got a contact on the ranch. Tells me Esteban always keeps his laptop in the main house, usually in his office. Gate to the right will take you straight there. Let's go to plan B.
Good job! Now let's finish what we started. <laughs>